Ramtech Career Center in Ohio is home to the largest, most comprehensive robotics education center in the U.S. The aim of Ramtech is to increase the number of skilled manufacturing employees to meet future market needs. Students spanning middle school to industry professionals now receive training on universal robots. We have a large group of industry people who advise us on what we should be covering in our curriculum. And a local company said they were going to buy collaborative robots. And so we did some research and realized that Universal had one of the best collaborative robots on the market. And so we purchased a collaborative robot because we always want to stay ahead of where manufacturing is going because as a, a school like Ramtech, we have to have the latest training. We can use the robot to teach to many different skill sets because it's, it's like peeling an onion. We can, we can put it down, bring it to some, some fifth graders and they can sit there and they can start programming and within a few minutes they can have the robot doing exactly what they told it to. Or we can bring it into a high school setting and we can have the high schoolers doing some more advanced motion controls and we can teach basic robot coordinate systems uh, all the way up to advanced programming and scripting techniques. Or we can teach it in the adult classroom uh, with many of our, our local large manufacturers. And it's really easy to do with the Universal as opposed to some of the other robots on the market right now. The UR robots, we came in and we sat down and Mr. Hammer showed us how it works and how you program it. And within two minutes, we had a basic program running. With the other robots, you have to test it and figure it out. and put it all on your computer and then run it and then go back and redo it and fix it. With these here, you can hit play and it'll run through it. We can start at the application level. And right here in the classroom, we can practice machine tending, like using a 3D printer. Or we can even do more advanced uh, integration. My teacher came to me asking, can you build a gripper for the UR3 because I don't want to go out and buy one. And I went online, I looked up a schematic of the faceplate of the UR3, and I started with just kind of building from the ground up, figuring out how to attach it, and then figuring out the actual gripper. And we're able to give them a large amount of ownership right off the bat, and that leads to a large level of engagement in the classroom. So one of the biggest advantages of using the universal robot in the classroom is the safety aspect. I can set it uh, in front of a bunch of high school students and I can give them a quick little demo and then say experiment and, and teach yourself. And I don't have to worry about one of them getting injured. If you accidentally put your hand in front of it, it would stop and the robots would just keep on going. Education, I think it's ideal. I think it's the future of education in robotics because you don't have to have the expensive safety cage. We could buy a couple universal robots for the price. We could buy an industrial robot with a safety cage. So we see the advantage there and they're really portable so we can move them around the room. And there's so many things a student can do with a universal robot that still fits into the industrial robotics model of education that we need. With the universals, it's so much easier to program them because you can move them the way you want them to move and not just touching the buttons and telling it what like degree to turn. You can move it yourself rather than having the computer do it for you. As a teacher, one of the things that makes it so easy to teach with the Universal is all the online resources. The simulator is a very powerful tool in the classroom because everybody learns differently and some of the students want to practice it many times and they can install the simulator at home because it's a free download. Then in the classroom, we can use it also as an assessment tool. Uh, so we can give them assignment and everybody can have their own laptop and everybody can program. We have the full access to all of the tech support. We don't have to pay a subscription fee to download all these technical documents. So we can tell the students, hey, let's write a script program to make the robot you know, do something fancy. And then we can just let the students figure it out just like they may have to in the real world. One of the flexibilities of the universal robot is the networking capability. And in industry these days, networking is a very big deal. And it's a very important skill set for our students to master. So in the classroom, we can have the PLC controlling the robots and we can have coordinated motion, having them picking and placing and working together in, in ways that the students have generated the logic to do that. The universal robots are, are a great way to get students and adults into training in the manufacturing field. If we could put more of those into schools and more training centers, then we're going to have a better trained workforce. Mm -hmm.